This video is going to show you how to do some blog comments um, and the procedure we'll use. Go to my web page and scroll over the home tab and you can see uh, the template that you need to use. Click on it and you'll see that it's a template much like any uh, Google spreadsheet. Um, what you'll need to do is you'll need to make a copy of this because you can't write on it. And of course I want you to put your name in front of the title. Once you have made your comment or your uh, your version, um, go ahead and you can see you can write in uh, to these different columns. Um, now, before you do anything, make sure you share it with me. Um, you'll notice that uh, once you've copied it, it's still private, so you need to share it with me. So I want you to use your Google collection, uh, your sociology Google collection, drag and drop it into that collection and this will share it with me. Okay, now let's make sure we're logged into Blogger because you need to be logged in in order to make any types of comments. Once we've made sure we're logged into Blogger, let's go back to my website and you'll go to Sociology tab, scroll over that and down below you'll see Sociology Blogs. Click on that and it's going to take you to a screen, uh, what's called NetVibes, and it collects um, our different blogs and any posts we put to our blog. So you can see mine, I have uh, seven posts, um, and whenever I put a new post, it'll just update in this blog. So I'll see that other people and myself have new posts. So uh, when you want to go ahead and start commenting on other people's blogs, uh, you can go ahead and click um, on this uh, screen here and it'll take you to um, a preview. So uh, you want to choose your classmate, don't use mine to, to comment, um, but in this case I'll just go ahead and use mine to, to leave a sample comment for you to show you how to do this. You'll notice you'll see a preview once you select your blog post. You see this preview and you'll see the B there above it, I want you to click on it, the actual title, and that'll take you to the actual post um, that you want to read and comment on. So you go ahead and read through it. Then you scroll, as you've read, you scroll down and you make a, a post. Make sure that you are signed in. You'll see that your name is down there in, uh, next to the Google parentheses. And you go ahead and just write whatever you want. Obviously, make sure you're, um, you're fulfilling those five steps that, that are talked about in the video that we watched in class. Now, once you've done that, you select Publish. Make sure that it's what you want to say. And then it'll ask you for a, a word or a code here to make sure you're not a computer and that you're actual human. Now, we're almost done. What we need to do is make sure that we turn this comment in, and this is how we do it. You just copy the comment or site URL now. You go back to that sheet that you created, and you paste it into the column, comment URL. And then you make sure you put the title of the comment, or of the post. And once you've done that, you're good to go. You go on to your next two comments um, and do the same process. The teacher will score here. Make sure it's shared. Make sure my name shows up. And now you've turned in your comment. And I can see it and grade it as is. If you click on it, you'll notice it goes directly to your comment that you've provided at the bottom of the post. I hope this helps.